The Space Shuttle Atlantis is planned for launch today from Pad A at Launch Complex 39. Although an accident during the first half minute of the flight is unlikely, some safety precautions are necessary. Potential danger exists from toxic vapors contained in any cloud or as a result of a launch mishap. In the event of an accident, all KSC personnel, news media, and invited guests on the Kennedy Space Center should take shelter in the nearest air conditioned facility as quickly as possible. Those viewing on NASA Causeway or the launch viewing site, not near an air conditioned facility, should take shelter in a bus or car with the windows closed. Please await further instructions, which will follow. Thank you. Minus 90 seconds in counting. Down suppression water system has been armed. Three main engines reported ready for ignition. seconds of counting, 45 seconds to long. Seconds into the flight, the three liquid-fueled engines are back at full throttle. 
That liftoff of pulling fuel shuttle boosters and external tank weighed four and a half million pounds. It now has burned half that liftoff weight in propellant. One minute, 30 seconds, all hydraulic systems in good shape. The electricity producing fuel cells also in excellent shape as Atlantis heads downrange. 18 miles from the Kennedy Space Center at an altitude of 18 miles. The next event is burnout and separation of the twin solid rocket boosters, which are burning propellant at a rate of 11,000 pounds per second.